morning, my people. What's up? What's up? Rats and riches. This is your girl, Stephanie Blue Ellen. Stephanie Blue Ellen, my people. Welcome back to Life is Real. How you doing on this Tuesday? Hope you changing your mindset. Are you changing your mindset? Are you still believing the, the lies? Yeah, I better wake up to the truth. Wake up to the truth. Go to God so he can tell you the truth about this world, about people. Wake up, my people. Wake up to what's going on in this world. It ain't what you think. We've been lied to our whole life. The world, society, the matrix, the devil, it then stole our happiness. It's, they stole our happiness, my people. We supposed to be happy. We supposed to be loving and giving and doing God's will in this world. But the devil stole it. The matrix stole it. They don't want us to, because they want us to work for them. They don't want us to be our own boss. People don't want you to be your own boss in this world. And some people don't want to be their own boss. You hear me? Some people do. I want to be my own boss. What's, what's more than being your own boss? Go to work when you want to. Get up when you want to. That's the best feeling ever. That's the best feeling ever. What's up, my people? Y'all got them naughties out your life. You still believe in the lies? They still got that mask on? You better snatch that mask off. Do something to make a mask so you can see how that person is so you can go on and get them out your life. Because they going to play good for the first four, five weeks of the relationship. And then they going to start acting crazy. We gotta stop accepting things that when people come in our life, we accept whatever they do. We can't do that no more. That's why we messed up out here. That's why we killing, stealing, and robbing. You hear me? Because we always want to do a payback. We don't do payback. We give that payback to God. Let God do that payback. You hear me? We don't do payback. That's that's why the world is is toxic and messy. Because we ain't giving them problems to God. Because we want them folks dealt with right then. But God going to deal with them. I gave God my haters. You hear me? I gave God my haters. I'm going to let God deal with them. So I can go on with my life and be happy. We can't be happy holding a grudge and mad and angry. You hear me? We ain't going to enjoy ourselves. Happy March, my people. It's finna be my birthday. It's finna be my birthday. How many more days I got? 17 more days. It's gonna be my birthday. I'm getting younger. <laughs> I'm getting younger. All right, you get that cash out. Dollar sign, Miss Unique Fluella, and send the girl some for a birthday. Send your girl something for her birthday, but I ain't want none of y'all just coming in checking on my subscribers, my 77 subscribers. I hope y'all stick with me. Y'all stick with me because you going to see that God is good. You going to see that God wants the best for all his kids. You going to see that the devil been lying to you for years and years and years. You going to see that the devil only wants you to be messed up out here. On crack. A hangover. All this type of evil stuff. The devil wants you to be on watching porn. You know God don't want you to do all this stuff. But people don't want to know the truth and hear the truth. They don't want to know the truth. They don't want to hear the truth. They don't want nobody in their face that's telling the truth. <laughs> Real talk, my people. But you need to wake up. You, you wake up, you have a better life. 
You wake up to what's really going on in this world, you'll have a better life. You'll know how to make it through the world. The world won't get you depressed. You hear me? See, the world get us depressed because we don't know how to move around through the world. Through the world, through the naughtiest. How to avoid the naughtiest. How to avoid all the, the little different little things they do to mess with people. When people be arguing stuff, ignore it, keep moving. You hear me? Because they want to pull you in to get your energy. This I'm telling you, it's all about energy. It's all about your mind, your heart, my people. Y'all, y'all can't believe I'm on here talking every day, don't I? I know. I'm shocked too. But when I came, when I got away from the knowledge, I wouldn't think about doing this. I would think about starting me a new life. But I did say I wanted to write me a book, be in my room, in my room drinking my wine. But I ain't know I'm going to be talking about God every day. You hear me? You'll be surprised what plans God have for you. And it's true. It's true. You never know when God got plans for you. When they told me, God, read the Bible, God wants you to be, you know, I was like, me? <laughs> me? Me, God? God want me? But it's a blessing. It's a blessing to know when somebody could use you. You hear me? Could use you, could use your, your voice and your ideas with which God give them to you, though, but... It's just a good feeling that all all the people in the world, God would choose you. That's why you got to be good in this world. God could use you. He might could use you next year or the year after or the year after. But you got to change your ways and your heart and your mind and do right. God could use you. It ain't too late. He want to help all his kids, but you got to come to him. You got to repent. You got to change and start doing things different. You hear me? We don't never want to do do a change. We get jealous of somebody else want to change, but we don't want to do the change. You hear me? But I'm so happy and blessed that God want to use me. God want to use me to help people. That is, that's, I think that's wonderful. That's a good, that's good. I appreciate it. It make me feel special. <laughs> it make me feel special. But I'm telling my people, if it ain't your time, it, you just got this going to straighten up. And it might be your time next year. You hear me? Uh-huh. I love y'all. I'll see y'all on my next episode. Deuces.